Why do my statistics keep on resetting? 15 seconds played. Hello? <laughs> um, alright. Here's some backstory. This is a hardcore world that I've been playing on for about two and a half days. But for some reason lately, my... All my statistics got reset, and it's so annoying. I did stream on this world twice already, but that's all the content that I've made of it. And I've wanted to make a YouTube video, but now I guess is the perfect time because I guess in the statistics, it's starting at the same time that most YouTube videos would. <sighs> but anyways, what are we gonna be doing today? As you can see, Wait, where's my beacon? Yeah, also, I have an iron farm. There it is. So at the start of this world, we are going to do the first thing that everyone does at the start of a hardcore world, and fight three withers. Yeah, you heard me right. Three. This, I've never tried before, and it will be terrifying. Oh my god, I got Monster Hunter! And I'm definitely not in full netherite. <laughs> uh, oh, diamonds. Why are there so many diamonds? I'm not even trying to strip mine. <laughs> this is amazing. Whew. This will be the biggest challenge out of this entire hardcore world. I have a totem. I have an extra totem. I have all my armor on. Let's do it. Nope. Oh. Come on. Whoa, 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 whoa. That's not good. I cannot believe that I already died. Oh, I got one of them. Here we go. I got the second one. Ah. Oh. And there we go. All right. That was the most terrifying thing in this whole entire world that happened. But now that we got that out of the way, I'm gonna get you guys all caught up on what has been happening and just give you a whole entire world tour. It's not too much, honestly. Yeah, I have my wheat field over here, my sugar cane over there, then this is the way that I got all my emeralds, so I can actually get overpowered. I didn't go into a single cave until I beat the ender dragon. So I just used villagers the entire time. And yeah, I got a bunch of sticks from all these spruce trees. Alright, so my game crashed again, and oh my god. I think my settings just... No! Why does this keep on happening? I haven't been playing for five seconds, I've been playing for like two and a half days. I just realized that while I was editing, I actually lost some recordings. So, here are my warts, here are my villagers, there are a couple more villagers down there, but that doesn't really matter at the moment, and then here are my two farms, my cow and my sheep pen. If I go this direction, this direction is spawn. And as you can see, this is actually a really cool world. <laughs> I love that there's like a giant ravine right here. But anyways, over here, I have an iron farm. There's a spawn right over here, just so it can always stay running. It doesn't have too much iron right at the moment, just because I took some iron out before. But anyways, yeah. And now back onto the video after it crashed. Where was I? <laughs> oh, right. Um, ah, oh, wow, why does the keep, this keep on ha- Perfect time. Well, actually, this is the- Is it thunderstorming? It's thunderstorming. Oh my gosh, this is actually an amazing time. I know for sure that I was about to go into the nether and then into the end, but, you know, I can't not do this. Look at that. Like, look at that. A throwaway joke. It's amazing. Oh! Oh! Let's go, zombie head! There we go! Whoa, 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 whoa! Whoa, there's a trident drowned somewhere. 
And no trident, obviously. But I believe that I have a world tour to get back to. So, goodbye, and I am glad to leave. And now that we have three zombie heads and two skeleton skulls, we can go into the nether and just see what's been going on in there. Okay, so the nether is the most terrifying part of this entire thing. Yeah, we need to go deeper. Don't don't mind this, or this, or, or this. This is the hole that I made. I almost died like three times down here. And just in case I had my chest plate on, I put, put some snow down. This is my hogland farm, this direction, so I can get unlimited pork chops, which is nice. And then over here is the direction that we have to go to get to my nether fortress that I will make into a wither skeleton farm. Now it's time to go to the end. Oh my gosh, how did I guess it? How did I guess the correct portal to go through to get I Spy instantly? And oh my gosh, it's a finished portal. That's insane. Here's my Enderman grinder. Here's where I got most of my levels. Very fun. But that's basically it. In this entire world, that is all that I've done in almost three days of playing. But anyways, I'm going to take some glass and some obsidian. Ice bucket challenge, let's go. And make three separate beacons that's insane i love that <laughs> and then yeah three beacons done see that now you're not the only beacon wait can beacons travel through beacons there you go nice but wow that was all i was gonna do for my intro and that took seven minutes. So we don't have too much video time left. So that means that I'm just gonna start building an actual starter base because I haven't quite done it yet. And it's just gonna be a house. And probably in the next episode, I'm gonna start on my mega base. And I already have the plans for that. That's gonna be really cool. And it's gonna involve the mob farm. But anyways, sorry I haven't uploaded for, for so long. Thank you for watching and please subscribe. Let's hit the time lapse. probably gonna be the end of this video um, so now that I actually have this house made I honestly kind of just built a house to build it <laughs> I don't really have too much of a use for it which might not be the best so I don't really know what I'll put into it but comment down below what I will be able to put into the house because I honestly don't feel like moving my things. I'm sorry I didn't upload for the past like two months. It's kind of like just school and stuff. I have things in my life that's happening and you know I think that I got burnt out for a little while just for like literally half a year. So I haven't really been uploading too much but anyways I hope you guys enjoyed and if you did enjoy subscribe and like the video. I'm at 195 subscribers so it would be really cool if we can hit 200 but anyways See you next video. See ya. And for my viewers who actually stayed to the end, thanks by the way, <laughs> I'm in spectator mode. Um, this looks pretty similar to the actual hardcore world and it's because it's the same seed. And that's because I'm just gonna give you a little bit of a sneak peek of what my base will look like. But anyways, that's enough of a peek. <laughs> See you next video, bye.